In prime time news this evening, police hold on to suspect after a four-month-old baby is stolen from his mother. Calls getting louder for the resignation of CPFSA head Rosalie Gage Gray. And not deterred, Hanover residents continue to dig for gold despite experts' opinion. Good evening and welcome to Primetime News on air and online at onespotmedia.com. I'm Giovanni Dennis. And I am Andrea Chisholm with a preview of what's to come in business news. Here's Javon Keys. It's Wednesday, so you know I'll have the latest gas prices update. And guess what? Some good news. I'm seeing all green arrows, which means gas prices are going down and they're at their lowest, some of them, since 2021. I'll give you the details later on. And standing by with the latest in sports is Jermaine Brown. Jermaine. Oh, thank you, Giovanni. <clears throat> well, our senior net ballers, they didn't shine against England in the opening match of their three-match series. We'll tell you how that match went a bit later on. There's also sports commentary, E-Prime, and weather in this newscast. But before the break, the feedback question. This evening we're asking, what has been your experience trying to clear unpaid traffic tickets? Share comments online, facebook.com slash television Jamaica, and tweet us at television jam one. Please stay with us. Primetime News returns right after this break. <laughs> 